Welcome back to the broadcast. You're watching the Monday Report. Let's now take you to Migori, where two people sustained gunshot wounds as police battled protesters during the Monday anti-government demonstrations. Now, demonstrators took to the streets in different towns within Migori County, with demos in Uriri and Nyarach towns turning violent. In Homa Bay County, businesses remained shut for the better part of the day as police and demonstrators clashed. Martin Munene now reports. Protesters took to the streets in different towns in Migori County on Monday, barricading roads, paralyzing transport along all major roads within the county. The demonstrators engaged police in a clash for hours, pelting police officers with stones, despite attempts by the police to disperse them using tear gas. Pius Oguna, a border border operator, was not lucky as he was caught in the crossfire. Oguna claims he was not part of the demo and was on his way to deliver a customer to Uriri when he ran into the clash between the demonstrators and the police. The two have since been transferred from Rongo Subcounty Hospital to Migori Referral Hospital for Specialized Care, even as police in the area deny knowledge of the shooting incident. <laughs> In Homabe County, these were the scenes in Homabe Town, running battles between the police and demonstrators. The events of the day paralyzing businesses in the town for over five hours, with journalists from various media houses having to take cover until calm was restored in the town. Similar scenes were witnessed in Raila's home of Bondo Siaya County. Police had had time-containing demonstrators who took to the streets as part of the anti-government protests with demonstrators touching tires and barricading roads. In Transazoya, the police had to use tear gas to disperse the crowds. The supporters are saying they will not stop taking part in the demos until the Miola Umoja leader Raila Odinga calls off the protests. We are the Kenyans. Yes. We are votes. Yes. We are stakeholders. Yes. We are shareholders. We are shareholders. We are shareholders. Martin Monene, Citizen TV.